Every morning when I wake up, I have this plan to work with these great meditations and exercises and to really go positive and bright into my life. And very soon I get overwhelmed with these fixed ideas I have about myself and my life. And I know it has all to do with the past. I wasn't talking about myself. It's about something that people tell me. So people tell me that I'm stuck and I'm basically stuck because something happened in my past and this dominates the now and it also it's like it shapes my destiny. Well, imagine that there was a country, a country, a land and it's been in war or there was a disaster, something happened like a fire or an earthquake. What happens then? You probably don't start meditating. People that some deeper forces in them are triggered. Survival. So this country is probably ruled by the, the Minister of Internal Affairs and National Security. Because the country needs to survive. The king, which could be like the, the soul, and the, min, the Minister of Internal Affairs, which could be the ego, they got separate. Well, when the consciousness is high, then the king and this minister of internal affairs, they will work together. But if we don't know these two very well, you will see that the king is withdrawing and we go into this survival mode. And it's possible if some bad things happened in your childhood, that you started to identify with that, that this became me. And then your life is basically fixed on that. The, the thoughts are not the problem. It's the charge that is built up around the thoughts. Everything that happened has happened. You can't change that. I don't believe in putting it somewhere in a box, giving it a place somewhere. The way of the alchemist is that there's a lot of potential and life force into that experience. Okay. The thing is, in this state of war, well, this minister, the ego, he doesn't know a lot about the people. He doesn't have the heart, the virtues to connect with the people. He doesn't know anything about the land, about the spirits of the, the whole land. And this is what you need to do then. Yes, the country has been in, the, in that state. Yes, you had this experience. Now, what is the potential that you have? You have a physical body. You have much more emotions. You have more virtue. You're connected to a bigger field. Leave this thing of the past for a while. Don't push it away. You have it there. But start to do all kinds of other things that cultivate what has not been used for a long time. Making cont quality contacts with people, experiences that you do. Going in nature. It's like discovering another part of yourself. Enjoying yourself. So gradually around this dark ball, you get other kind of experiences with yourself, more energy, more consciousness, and then this gives you the ability that this new identity, or maybe you discover this is really who I am, starts to absorb the darkness, the emotion, the charge from this old experience. You need enough momentum connect, and enough positive quality, I mean high vibrational quality of your being to be able to draw the negativity from the experience. It doesn't work by keeping focused on it, because then, well, it's like you 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 run around in in a normal city in the West with an armor from the medieval times. That's the way many many people walk around. They're still in some kind of war, but the war is gone. They don't have a life besides the war. So I think you can picture it very well. Start to discover, open up for new, simple things that you can have build new experiences, a new form to identify yourself with life, going deeper with your core 
and with these four dimensions of life that everybody is, might look like there's only emotions and this pain and the experience, but there's much more for all of us. There's nobody who misses one of the dimensions of life. We all have a physical body, we feel, we think, and connect it to something bigger. In my experience, it's the, the most effective way. You don't focus on the problem, you cultivate the potential that is around it so that it can absorb the charge. And guess what? At a certain point, what you will see is, and I've seen this so many times, what happened there and that looked like it's going to be your end was creating the greatest transformation inside of you. Because you had to overcome it by using your deeper virtues, which you maybe took for granted before. Now you overcame that and it changes you for the rest of your life. So, wishing you a lot of success and no hurry. <laughs>